Greenman Island has a bunch of these types of underground tunnels. Some of them are really huge and they can take small naval vessels. Others are smaller and they were more a safe haven for soldiers during wartime. Now I did two clips on these kind of tunnels. The one is Tsai San, which is this one, and then I did another one on the Tenggong coastal defense tunnels that you can see on my blog page. Now the Tsai San tunnels were completed in 1966 and they have a length of 101 meters and a width of 6 meters and they are 3.5 meters high. Inside the Tsai San tunnels there are 7 rooms that served as barracks for soldiers. The Tsai San tunnels feature a unique A-shaped waterway and canal. These waterways stretch over 357 meters in length, 11 meters in width and 8 meters in height, which made them a perfect place to conceal small naval vessels. And at this size, even if you were claustrophobic, I think you'd be okay in here. Now as you can imagine, these tunnels require a lot of money and manpower to maintain. So, due to a lack of both manpower and money, they were closed down in 1986. However, they remained a national historic site. So, in 1997, the Kinman National Park took over the maintenance and administration of these tunnels. Under the agreement with the military defense, the military is still allowed to access the tunnels under threat of war or if they are conducting exercises. And the Kinman National Park has also found a very creative use of these tunnels, with musical performances taking place on little floats inside the tunnel. Now I couldn't find a lot of English information about this, but I did manage to find a YouTube clip that somebody took of one of these performances, and I would say it's pretty spectacular. The Zai San tunnels are open every day with the exception of Chinese New Year and if you want to visit these tunnels I'll put their Chinese name as well as their Google Maps marker on my blog page. <laughs>